Ah, what is going on, people? The Witch Doctor, and I was holding off on making this video for a while. I know I'm late, but I really wanted to wait on Wishy Washy. I love fish Pokemon, and honestly, even after seeing that giant, massive school form of Wishy Washy, it looks amazing. I really love it. But still, as of right now, my favorite Sun and Moon Pokemon still is Bruxus, and I just love Bruxus' design. I love what it can do. It, it, it's I'm, I'm just waiting for stats. I'm still probably going to use it regardless of its stats, but uh, I really like that one as of right now. Wishy Washy, on the other hand, is probably my second favorite because it is an awesome looking fish. I love the little, I actually kind of like the little fish form a little more than the big Goliath fish. It, it's weird as that sounds. Um, I like both, actually. I really can't decide. But I want to talk about today, I know it's been revealed a while back, but I really wanted more information on this thing before I gave my honest opinion on it, and I like it. I just do not like schooling the ability too much sense. It, it does say after a certain... If it goes below a certain amount of health, it will revert back into this little form. I just really hope that... <clears throat> when it changes into the schooling form that it it does get a significant boost in stats or else this thing will not be as viable I like what Sun and Moon are doing I would really prefer if they would just make evolutions I these alternate forms by abilities isn't something that I like too much since you know, obviously, you in order to get to the form, or you change back by hitting a certain amount of HP and stuff like that. I really think they screwed over Zygarde like that, and I feel as if Zygarde is even not even that important anymore, to be honest. And I just don't like that whole ability changing form thing. It's not too great, but it says that Wishy Washy itself is a little weak fish, and it turns into a gigantic uh, fish here that uh, is, you know, even Gyarados is scared of it, which I think is cool. Uh, again, I don't see me using this fish too much unless it has a good form of recovery for it can get its HP back up to, you know, for it to go back into this giant fish, which is what I hope would happen if it, you know, went above, if it got the HP back, it would transform again. Uh, I don't know. Maybe if... I doubt this thing would get recover, but you know, I don't see how fish Pokemon could even get recover. I don't even know if there is a fish that gets recover uh, besides Pylotic. I think that's about it. So maybe a citrus berry will work nice on this thing, or I don't know. Like leftovers plus aqua ring is like my only thing. Maybe protecting and stuff like that. That could work. That could probably work. Maybe. I doubt it, but <laughs> I really don't know. To be honest with you guys, I really don't know. But, uh, my final thoughts on this thing is that it's cool, but I feel that the ability really isn't all that. Yes, it turns into this really cool looking fish, and that's the sad part, it's really cool looking. But it's a little disappointing knowing that it will revert at a certain amount of HP. Unless this thing gets like some monstrous stats, then I can understand it reverting back, and I'll be perfectly okay with that. But, if it doesn't, then I'm not too crazy about it. So I know there's ways to probably help it. Like I said, maybe if it gets Aqua Ring with Leftovers and Protect, you could help it out a bit with that. Uh, on the other hand, it probably wouldn't be too great, but hey. <sighs> so what we get, we're getting these new forms instead of evolutions, which I really would want instead of these forms, because this thing as an evolution would be great, but it's not, so what can you do? Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I will talk about more Pokemon later on, just not so quick as everyone else is doing it, because I like to really see what the Pokemon can do or more information on it before I start talking about it. But uh, yeah, so far I'm really enjoying all the Pokemon that are coming out for Sun and Moon. And with that said, guys, Dog.